Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Hermitcraft Mode Souls 2. <laughs> I look really weird. <laughs> Aww, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, it looks really weird um, with, <laughs> with the helmet off. <laughs> it's because everything's so big. Like, it just looks, it looks really weird. Um, yeah, there we go. There we go. And so I did some work uh, on the house, or the base, the b -b 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 base. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, here we go. Yeah, I likes it. I like it a lot. Um, I was, I was... I was just messing around, I was messing around and on this one here or no it was this one and I, I just put the white going around because I only had a few blocks and so I was like all right just do this part here and then I like I took it like I flew back and the dirt was still there I was like man that actually looks really freaking cool um and then I went through several blocks and I and I put up I, I hooked this guy up here I uh, started getting a bunch of ice because I wanted to try the packed ice. Oh, packed. <laughs> packed. Uh, the, the packed ice chisel blocks. Uh, actually, over here. Um, but it turns out uh, when you make packed ice, uh, the item ID is 174. And the item IDs of these are 1185. Um, so it just it doesn't work. It just like it just doesn't work. <laughs> so yeah. Um so I just I decided to go with this. Uh this is called Vena Vena. Uh, it's from Z Tones. It's got a decent little texture going on and a nice color. And I, I realized that people were saying that like due to YouTube compression, uh this doesn't look very good. But like there's nothing I can do about that. <laughs> Like, I can't make YouTube compress it less. I mean, I, like, I use settings that are perfect for YouTube, so there shouldn't really be uh, any compression. It's just, that's the way it goes. Like, it, I mean, it obviously looks better on, like, 720. So, and then, like, here it is, like, up close and personal. <laughs> so, and it, I mean, it's more of, like, when you're, you know, when you're moving around and stuff, like, it, it blurs for me in the game, too. So, yeah. Uh, but you can see this guy here, uh, I'm marking something out. Uh, you probably can't guess what it is. Points, if you can, uh, before I say what it is. <laughs> Not after I say what it is, and you're like, I knew that's what it was. Uh, this is going to be a big reactor. Yeah, we're going to put a big reactor up in here. Uh, it's going to be a 13 by 13 Right? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. 13 by 13. Uh, it's going to be six blocks, seven blocks tall. One, two, three, seven blocks tall. And it's going to be two blocks away from the wall. And then we're going to have, you know, like some supports, I think, coming out of the corners. Uh, well, support looking things. <laughs> uh, to make it look like it's not floating, I guess. Um, so yeah, that's going to be a thing. I've decided I'm going to go with big reactors. I mean, I, I just, I'm sick of like worrying about power. You know, if I want, like I've I hooked up, like this is a resonant machine and I put all the augments in it and the power just went. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, same with these. Uh, I put the augments in this one and it just, bleh. of course this thing uses 8,000 RF a tick with all the augments in it. The speed augments. Yeah. It's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. Uh, but you can see we've got some Eulorium right there. And so what we need to do is we need to uh, make stuff. Big Ractors. Big, yeah, gotta love those big Ractors. <laughs> uh, big Reactos. <laughs> the big Reactos are cool too. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, so we're going to need a, a bunch of this. Uh, because that's pretty much required for everything else. Uh, there's going to be 16 reactor control rods. Uh, we'll need a couple of power taps. We'll need a couple access ports. Uh, we're not going to get into the turbines quite yet. Uh, we might get into those like you know later on down the road. Uh, we're also going to need a couple of these redstone ports. 
And yeah, so we're just gonna need a bunch of this. Uh, so we're gonna need a bunch of graphite, which I think we have a little bit of coal. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's only 29,000. I wish it was more, but you know, we, we could do. Yeah, this thing hasn't run in a couple days, like at all. Like it's just, it's dead. It's just sitting there. All right, let's get some graphite going. Should, there we go. And it should, yes it is. And it should go in here. And then we should, <laughs> we should see it up in here. Uh, hmm. I think, aha, <laughs> I have found it. Hmm. Hmm, what to do, what to do, take a poo. Um, you know what, we can actually get rid of that. Um, where's our key? We can unlock that, we don't need, we don't need a thing there for Flint. Uh, there we go. All right, so it all going there. Eey, fall off the edge. And yeah, there it goes. All right, so we'll get that coming in. Um, and then we're going to need, let's see if there's anything else special we need, just a bunch of iron and stuff like that. Uh, redstone, reactor casings, diamonds, like, you know, the usual kind of stuff. Um, and I'm going to fill it with uh, liquid ender pearl, because why not, really? I mean, there's there's no real point uh, a reactor this size to use gelid cryothium. Like, it's not enough of a boost. Uh, and you could say I've already got this guy over here. Uh, just so I can... Actually, isn't there... It's not called a flood. There's something from Mechanism. Mecha. Oh, God, that Mechanism. Every time... Oh. Every time I search Mechanism, <laughs> it does that. Uh, there's something from Mechanism that lets you flood an area. I'm just wondering what it is. Oh, what is that? Solar neutron activator? <laughs> A machine that directs neutron radiation of the sun into its internal reservoir, allowing for the slow creation of various isotopes. All righty. All right, so let me let me figure out what this uh, what the machine is that let's so that yeah it's like the floodgate but it's from mechanism I think it's from okay ah I think that's it I think that's it I think that's it is that it is that it shift M Machine that is capable of creating entire lakes by filling the ravines with fluids. Aha! So we need one of these guys. Electric pump. Oh yeah, we got all that. All right, let me get some stuff together, and I'll be back. Alrighty, uh, so I've got the majority of it put together. I do have a layer of cobblestone. I was going to fill the entire thing with source blocks, but I was like, why am I going to do that? That's just, that seems lame. <laughs> why would I do that? Uh, and I'm not, I'm not completely, sh like, this thing here, like, does it fill below it? Or does it fill at its level? Or, or what? Like, I, I, I have no clue. Um, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be a learning experience, uh, to say the least. So I figured I would do it on camera, just in case, uh, you guys aren't familiar. I mean, it looks like it does below it. So hopefully, I mean, I guess if it does fill at its level, or start filling at its level, uh, we can always break it. Um, and I'm assuming that the fluid goes in the top. And it does. Very good. Very good. Very good. We will give it power. And it will do things, and it will be glorious. Ooh. <laughs> That's... And it's not coming in very fast. That's all right, though. It's all right. It should get it. It's getting it. Very nice. Hopefully, it doesn't go beyond the wall. Hopefully, it recognizes that there's walls. <laughs> uh, 
Okay, do things. Do things. And I do have buckets, you know. Alright. As soon as it's all still, it's done. It's not quite as fast as the floodgate, but... Like, that's like the most useful... Uh, build craft block. Oh, dang it, no! <laughs> Alright, let's take that out. Alright, because I mean, we're done with that guy. And so now we need to fill the center. So, there we go. And then we'll get this bad boy put together, and we will give it some fuel, and see how she do. Let's see. One there, looks like we need one over there. Aha! Alright, so now I think what I'm going to do is we're going to have the access ports up here. Uh, along with the power taps, like that. And then uh, the rest of this is going to be glass. And then, aha, that guy, blam, right there. Oh, yeah, we're good. Okay, give me that and that. Oop, nope, nope, I need that. Thank you. Thank you. All right, and we will get this filled in, and everything will be glorious. Hopefully, I should have enough. <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> I gotta take out the freaking cobble. Okay. Uh, oh, dang it. Uh, aha. I wish you could set the, the block replacer or the block exchanger to re exchange air. Like, to just dig up blocks. Like, I guess I could... Well, yeah, I don't... Yeah, I don't know if it does torches. Like, I know the... the Thumbcraft wand uh, will shut up. Uh, will replace blocks with torches, and then the torches like update and fall. <laughs> or ladders. I know it'll do ladders. I'm just not sure about the resonant exchanger. Like if it has the same mechanics or what. So all right, get in there. I'm going slow. I just don't want to break a hole in the side. That's pretty much all that is. <laughs> ah, okay, we're done. All right, let's get this filled in. Ooh, it's kind of weird looking. There, there, there. And then hopefully this becomes like a thing. <laughs> uh huh. Good, very good. Ah oh, man, it's been so long since I've built one of these. <laughs> since Infinity, that was a while ago. And that was like early Infinity too. Like, I, oh man, it's been a while. I love it. Love it. Do it. No. What happened? What is what is missing? Ah. Uh, what is missing? You can have glass under these, right? I sure hope like you I could have swore you could. Maybe not though. I mean maybe maybe not. Uh, a reactor, reactor casing, let's just grab some of that, thank you. Alright, yeah, I could have swore you could have glass under the fuel rods. Hopefully that's all it is. I don't think I messed anything, like, it's all full of glass. <gasps> oh, duh. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. Okay. That was, that was, that was face palm right there. That was, that was face palm. And boom. Get wrecked. That was me jumping for joy, not trying to fly and failing. <laughs> All right. So we need to give this guy some fuel. All right, let's grab some Eulerium. Ah, I hate not being able to right click. Um, let's do, let's do, let's just do some uh, Eulerium blocks. And then that leaves a... Uh, yeah, okay. Uh, just so it fills up faster. And then, yeah, we'll worry about getting more fuel over here. All right, so that's import. I want this one to be export. Give it fuel. Everything is good. And boom. Do things. All right, we're at 20. 20, 30. 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. 39. Oh, 40. 
Yeah, I know. It's, yeah, whatever. Uh, the heat is not great. <laughs> the heat is not great. Uh, the, the reactivity is decent. Uh, the fuel usage is decent. The heat uh, could be better. But we're, we're kicking out 40k uh, per tick. Nice. All right, let's go down. Let's go downstairs and see how she looks. Yeah, I like it. I like it. I may replace the bottoms uh, with reactors or with casing. Just yeah, I think I am. All right, let's do this. So it looks like that tiniest bit better, I think. Go. Oh no 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 no! That's not what should happen. <laughs> Don't do that. I don't like it when you do that. All right. And the good thing about big reactors is they keep everything when you break them. Boom. And yeah, that does look better. Maybe we'll we'll figure out some kind of design or something for the bottom. I think that might be kind of cool. I wonder, does the resonant exchanger work on this? Because if it does, like if let's see, let's grab that. And then let's grab our exchanger. Thank you. Oh, dang. That sucks. I was really hoping it worked on that. But whatever. Alrighty. Uh, so I want to touch on something real quick. Um, there was someone that mentioned a while ago, don't use big reactors because it'll crash you. Uh, I think what they were doing is they were right clicking on it with a pick. Um, and in this pack, there is a mod called Torch. Uh, it was torch tools or something like that. Um, that's what causes it to crash when you right click on it with a pick. But as you can see, uh, it's not doing that to me uh, because we've removed um, torch tools <laughs> from ours. Uh, it just it it's more of a pain uh, than it's really worth. Um, and I went ahead and got the redstone port set up here. Uh, this guy is set to set from signal, and this guy is set to active well below sixty percent. Uh, so it when uh, this drops below 60%, uh, it'll kick on, and then once it like gets above 60%, it'll kick off. So hopefully that's hopefully it's good enough. We'll we'll have to do some testing. Uh, but what I want to do is I want to grab these. Uh oh. <laughs> uh. Hold on. Let's see, let's get rid of some stuff. You and you. And that's, yeah, that's everything. All right. So what we're going to do <laughs> is we're going to place some monitors or some capacitor banks up in here. And all right. So now we should be able to do this. Oh yeah, look at that. That's gonna be glorious. Glorious. Alright, let's see how much this is gonna hold. Oh, oh, 390. 405, 420, 435. And that should be... Oh yeah, I did my math right. <laughs> nice. Alright, so now what I want to do is change all of these to the screen. All right, as soon as we click this one over, it should become one screen and boom. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. All right, so we need a test rack that's set to send energy or receive energy. All right, so that's that guy. And I think for now, we'll stick it right there. 8,000. Really? They can take 465. Oh, you know why? We don't have anything sending it energy. <laughs> All right, so this is set to energy receive. This one is set to energy send. Stick that there. Energy send. Okay. And 8,000. What? <laughs> Uh, let's see. What did I do wrong? Where are you? You are... I think we will go to main. Ah, there we go. 
All right, so that's on main, receive, boom. I wish it was bigger. <laughs> like, the screen is huge. All right, but this little bit here in the center is kind of... So I think what, oh, what we're going to do is we're actually going to... Let's see, that's one, two, three, four, five. We're going to make it smaller just because, I mean, like, we don't really need <laughs> that many... It would be nice if I could get one of those displays instead of like this to show like how much energy is in it, but I'm pretty sure that's not a thing. Yeah, we can go even smaller. <laughs> even smaller. There we go. And if we wanted to, I think we can paint these, but I'm not completely sure. And this will become a, what is it, the dimensional transceiver thing? Uh, that guy right there. Yeah, fluids and power wirelessly across any distance between dimensions. Uh, that will become one of those just so I can paint it uh, to match everything else. Yeah. And then this guy over here, this is going to be for storage. Uh, that's going to be for storage. And then I don't think I'm going to have one here. I might. I might. Uh, but there's going to be barrels across here. There's going to be barrel or not barrels. Um... <clears throat> uh, storage drawers across here and there. I just got to figure out how to wire them together. That's the problem. I may bring this wall out. Well, then I would have to bring... The, well, no, yeah, because then I could run up through... Because this stuff can't be micro-blocked. Uh, this can. And then if I could run it... I'm trying to think of how to run cables. If we can run cables up and then across here somehow and then down. Hmm. Yeah, we'll have to figure that part out. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure how uh, how to do that, like how to go about that. I think I'm going to have to do like a, like, like a, a tesseract for that side, maybe a tesseract for that side. And then like it'll hopefully, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know how to do that part. I really don't. All right, so now that we have power, uh, let's go ahead and chunk load this bad boy. Um, where to? I think if we just put it right there. All right, let's go see how much that covers. Do, 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 do. Oh, oh, fly! All right, so that's everything on this side. Everything on that side, and everything on that side. Very nice, very nice. Yeah, and I got this little guy up here just with the fuel, and then this is for the... Ooh, I got it. Okay, cool. Lock. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for, is to get some, some waste up in there. All right, so now what we need, now that we have energy... Oh, that's going to suck through all that energy. <laughs> that is... How much is that? 465 million RF right there. And like no frame hit. So that is awesome. That is, that is awesome. All right. So now we need, I think, I think we need a quarry. I need to get these guys moved over. So let me get ahead. Let me get ahead, <laughs> get ahead and do that. And yeah, I'll be back. Well, I think I've done a pretty good job of cleaning this up with all the storage drawers and all that kind of stuff. Um, they're all uh, over here. <laughs> nice and tidy and all of that. I might move that one. Like, actually, you know what? I'm going to. Uh, let's move that down. Move that down. Move that over. Move that up. Aha. Aha. <laughs> I don't know why. It, it doesn't matter. Uh, so, yeah, I've got the, the, the more valuable items on this side and the lesser valuable items on this side. Um, I guess I could put them, like, in order of value, and then I can move, like, all of these uh, all the way, like, maybe down here somewhere. <laughs> uh, they were clogging up the inventory. Uh, so I've got two storage houses on here now. This is uh, basically the one that w that started over there. Ooh, actually... See, and I keep scrolling through here, seeing new stuff I need to add to the the non-valuable side, which is that right there. 
Uh, so I just, oh, I forgot that guy there. Uh, so I just go like that and then stick that there. And then I give it like an upgrade or two. Uh, you know, like everything has at least one upgrade just so it's all green. Um, I could do the lapis upgrades just so they're blue, which would look better, but it wouldn't be uh, as good. Um, and so I have this, uh, this import bus right here. Uh, it's just, you know, it, wire goes under the, this covers and stuff right there. And so when I bring over a new one, I just go like this, slap it there, and then it gets drained eventually. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's it's going. <laughs> uh, and that's going up here. Right there. All right. Uh, this is just, like, this is a temporary thing with this cable stretching up like that. Um, it'll it'll change. Don't worry. <laughs> Don't worry. Don't worry. It will change uh, eventually if I ever get around to, to doing it. And then that's done. Then we break it and we're good. All right. And then I need to get the Cinnabar out of there. But I'll, I'll, I'll do some more off camera. Um, I had to add uh, another storage for this because I, I had these in there. Uh, the quintuple, quadruple, triple. Uh, so you can see they're there. They were clogging up the inventory too. Oh, that one's actually empty. Uh, this one's got a slightly higher priority. This one's got priority two. Uh, this one's got priority zero. And that one's got priority 20. Uh, so it always tries to send it there first. Uh, and if we can't send it up there, it sends it there. And then if that one gets full, it'll send it there. <laughs> and I may stick another one around here somewhere. Maybe like back here or something. I don't know. Um, I need to get uh, a quarry going, I think. Because I think we're pretty good. Like we've got most of the stone stuff in here. Uh, we've got all, like I say, the shards and stuff. Um, the main thing that would clog it up is like the ores. Uh, but, you know, we can we can set up processing and all that stuff soon so yeah this place is coming along man i like it i like it. the giant screen back here telling me that there's zero in and out <laughs> yeah I, I actually have this guy running off the me channel uh, which is taking power from the cow farm there and from that guy down there so yeah it's not pulling from that because like i don't want i don't want that draining like all the fuel from that so yeah. All right. Uh, but I think that's going to do it for today. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the episode and I will see you all next time.